It's your boy Mo signing off for Fresh Colorway. And today, we gonna talk about whether you should hold a sale, the Jordan 4, Midnight Navy. And I need you to join the Fresh Crew. How you join the Fresh Crew? You click like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and follow us on social media at Fresh Colorway on Facebook, TikTok, and Instagram. I know that's right. Now before we get started, make sure y'all check out my video from yesterday where we took an in-depth look at the Jordan 4 Midnight Navies. And I'm gonna link that video above so you can check it out. Now when determining the price of what these shoes will resell for, I like to refer to StockX because that's globally accepted as the market on the shoe on the secondhand market and what you can resell it for. We also use the sale data from StockX to determine comparable shoes, that's shoes with the same silhouette and the same type color blocking to determine on how this one will perform in the future. Now the first shoe we gonna look at is the Jordan 4 White Cement from 2016. Now this shoe released on February 13th of 2016 and it was based almost exactly like the OG model. It did have a Nike Air on the back of the shoe, which made it a pretty dope release. Now currently this shoe is hovering right around $500 in my size 12. Now it first got to this $500 point right around 2020, so that's about a four year time frame that it took from release day to get to $500 reselling on the market. And if you look at the historical data, just about all these shoes are about 500 right now. So just about any size you would have got in this shoe at that time would have performed about the same. Now the reason I chose that as the primary shoe to compare it to is because when you look at this shoe, it's the exact same color blocking, except for everywhere where it's black on the OGs, it's like that midnight navy blue on this shoe. Now the next shoe I wanna use as a comparable will be the white Oreo 4 that released in 2021. Now this shoe is hovering right around the 385 to 400 price point and this shoe released only like a year ago. This shoe released in July of 2021 and it took until about October to hit right around that $400 price point. So on release day, these shoes were reselling about 280, 270 in a size 12. And literally three months later, it was up to $400. Now both of these comparable shoes are basically all white Jordan 4s with a predominantly white leather upper. And the only difference is, is the colorway. Slightly different, but still very comparable shoes with the silhouette and the color blocking. So when you take a look at the Jordan 4 Midnight Navy, there's no doubt in my mind that this shoe will be a $400 shoe in about four to six months. And I am referring to only men's sizing currently. Now let's take a look at the grade school sizes. Now the money maker on these shoes are definitely gonna be the grade school sizes. Now the grade school sizes on the Jordan 4 Midnight Navies retail at $160. It's about $172, $175 after tax depending on where you buy the shoe from. Now we are gonna stay looking at these Oreo 4s because if you take a look at the resale price on these, they started off very low on release day, but then you gave it about three, four months and they was hanging around a $400 price point. So the grade school sizes were selling just as much as the men's sizes, but the price point was about a hundred or so dollars cheaper. And the same is true for the white cement fours because all the grade school sizes there are hanging around the four to $500 price point also. Now when purchasing grade school, you wanna stick to size five and a half up to seven. And when purchasing men's sizes, you typically want to stay between 10 and a half and 13. So my final conclusion on whether you should hold a sale the Jordan 4 Midnight Navy is absolutely you should hold these shoes. I would definitely grab at least four or five pairs, you know, depending on what your budget is. But I would definitely try to stick to grade school sizes if possible. Men's sizes will be easier to move, but the grade school to return will be much higher. So it's totally up to you what you do. But I want to hear from y'all down in the comments section below are y'all gonna grab some of these shoes to hold y'all gonna invest in these shoes are y'all gonna quick sell all the pairs y'all get and Drop i need you to join the fresh crew how you join the fresh crew you click like on this video subscribe to the channel and follow us on social media at fresh colorway on facebook tiktok and instagram it's your boy mo signing out for fresh colorway and i'll catch y'all on the next one